Welcome to the most boring, the most absolutely boring contentless vlog you will ever watch in your life. I'm telling you, this will be the most boring vlog you ever watch. That's okay. I'm just, I wanted to take you guys around my day today because I have a lot of errands to run. Probably some of the most tedious errands, like the most, the most annoying kind that like exists. For example, I bought some reading glasses that don't fit my head because my head's too big. They squeeze my temples so tight that it like hurts really bad and I get headaches from them. Actually, let me show you them. So basically, I already have a pair of glasses that I really like, but I was like, you know what, I kind of want another pair just to treat myself, you know, for being a good noodle. Although these are cute, they're kind of ugly. After we return those, we have to go to Lululemon and return some leggings. Oh, but then last but not least, most excitingly, I'm going to get my hair redone because as you can see, my roots are really bad. See, this is the most boring vlog. Like, I'm so sorry. Like, this is just, you shouldn't want to see this. I mean, if you decide to stay, thank you so much, but I promise my next video will have a little bit more of something going on. But I just thought it'd be fun. But to start of my day, we're making some coffee. So let's just get right into it. Also, good news. Ow. Good news is my mom ordered a milk frother. So let me show you a little bit of that. Look how dope this is. I don't know if you can see it. You can't really see any of it. And then it turns into foam. It turns into foam. And then you're good. <gasps> oh! oh my god, it's so good. Sorry, I hate to vacuum in front of you, but take a straw, mix that boy up. That's one sexy latte. Thumbs up from me. Oh, and do you know what? To spice things up a little bit too, I might even get lunch too. Just when you thought, you know, you were gonna unsubscribe or something, think again, fam, because we have a huge day planned filled with pointless activities. Returning glasses, returning leggings, getting my hair done, getting lunch. It's gonna be insane, bro. In the fucking mad brain. Do you know what? No, this is why today's vlog is not gonna suck because there's a little plot twist. I have to return the leggings, the glasses, and get lunch all before two o'clock because I have to be back in my hometown by three so that I can get my hair done. So then there's like a little conflict, right? Because for all good stories, you need a conflict and a resolution and a rising action and shit. Yeah, I went to school. <laughs> Crazy, right? That's going to be our little like thing that keeps you on the edge of your seat throughout the video so that you don't click off. Please don't kick click off. Please don't kick off. Please don't kick off. <laughs> Please don't click off. All right, bye. Haha, <laughs> sup, bitch? Sorry, um, I have a lot of zits right now, so ignore that. One right here. So painful, dude. It hurts so bad. Let's skedaddle. Kind of sad because I really want to be drinking my coffee right now, but I can't because just brushed my two furs, and um, when I drink the coffee, it tastes like ass. Let's talk. While we're on our way to return the leggings and shit, you already know what we're doing. I don't need to say it again. While we're driving, let's talk about some stuff. I have a few things on my mind. <clears throat> Number one, see these new glasses I just got from Free People? Shout out to Free People. These were really overpriced. The new trend these days that I kind of don't know if I want to get on yet. So let me know what you think down in the comments if it's like a stupid trend or if it's a trend that's a good trend. Mini little glasses. I don't know, okay? I kind of want to Get some, like little mini, like little glasses. Fuck. Okay, do you know what? Cross the goddamn street or don't, okay? How? Excuse you. I don't know. I don't know. Jesus Christ. Oh my God, motherfucker. Running in the street with her fucking baby. Bitch, no. Don't run in the street with a baby. That's just fucked. Anyway, sorry about that. No, okay, I'm about to get hit by a bus now too. Bitch, we have... <laughs> We really also I don't even know if these glasses look good on me yet because I literally like bought them and then like didn't try them on And like this is my first time wearing them So if I look like super fucking dumb right now, which I probably do I'm just like sorry. I I just I don't know It's so hard for me to find glasses that fit my head shape. My head isn't like that big, but it just like I don't know. It's round as fuck. So it just doesn't fit everything you feel me I don't know. I just have a round head born with it. What can you do? It sucks But you get what you get and you don't be upset my head looks like a like a melon, but like more of a cantaloupe because it's like kind of like really Do you know what? I'm just gonna stop. Let's have some coffee. Let's see if my toothpaste wore off yet Ugh, no, it didn't that's the thing, but I'm still gonna drink it I put it in a little travel cup because I really be that hoe <laughs> 
you're wondering, I get really heavy highlights. I've literally been doing it since eighth grade, so I just look better blonde. I'm not, I don't care. I don't care if it's summer, winter, fucking, I don't care. Oh my God, oh my God, what? Okay, <laughs> sorry, I thought somebody ran over a squirrel, but it was actually just a stuffed animal on the road, so I don't know how that happened, but anyways. I don't know, okay? But also, here's another thing. See, I'm just like ranting about random shit, but I'm sorry, like, this is all you're getting today. I don't have anything interesting to do, so this is what you're fucking getting. I tend to have like oily hair, like my hair gets oily really quickly and easily or whatever. So, uh, if you bleach your hair, it definitely dries out your hair, but my hair is so oily that it actually makes my hair like normal. I don't have to wash my hair for like four days. It's so nice. I hate showering. I hate brushing my teeth. I hate showering. I just like to be fucking, I don't know, dirty. Flossing? Oh my god, it's too much! I can't do it anymore. It's not like we always did that shit. That's all new, okay? I don't think no homeo sapiens were fucking picking out pieces of grass from the ground to pick out stuff in their teeth. Hell no! <laughs> Holy shit, that was kind of scary. I felt like I was gonna swerve. I'm using Siri to type this, so comma, you know how that is. Dead ass. We're using Siri out here in this bitch because we don't text and drive, fam. Okay, I'm gonna fucking stop this now. <sighs> These glasses look so bad on me. I don't know why I bought them. Okay, sorry. Okay, we're here. Honestly, I'd bring my camera in there, but already returning shit is so awkward. Like, I don't really have an excuse. It's just awkward. It's like you go in there and you're like, hi, like, I'd like to return these. They're like, oh my god, why? And I'm like, because your product sucks. No, I'm just kidding. I actually really like Warby Parker and Lululemon both. So like, it's not personal. It's just that they didn't fit me. Hi, welcome to Warby Parker. <laughs> what brings you in here today, may I ask? Well, you know, I really hate to do this, but the glasses that I bought from here squeeze my fat melon head way too tight and I need to return them. Please. Well, our glasses weren't designed to fit melon heads like you, but I'll get you a full refund anyways. Uh, sorry. That's what I like to hear. Is there anything else I can do for you? Yes! Give me a fat smooch! I have two hours until I need to be leaving this bitch so that I can go get my hair done. I hate returning things because the staff always seems so sad. It just happened to be literally the person who helped me pick out the shape was the person who helped me return them. And so that's just even more sad because it's like he feels like bad. He's like, oh wow, I really up like she doesn't even like the glasses I picked out for her. I felt so bad. Ugh. I feel bad, but now let's go return the leggings. For some reason, I feel less bad about returning the leggings. Maybe because it's I'm deep down angry at Lululemon because they can rip you off so hard. Like those leggings are so overpriced. Honestly, my camera's shaking. I'm just gonna end this clip because I don't want to put you guys through that. I'm ending the clip. I'm ending it. The clip is over. Don't jaywalk. Sorry. Anyways. Hi, what brings you into Lululemon today? First order of business, get your foot out of my face, please. Oh, sorry, let me readjust. Ugh. Okay, I think that's almost worse. Whatever, it's fine. I'm in here today because I need to return some leggings that are a little bit too small. I think your first mistake was buying galaxy leggings, but whatever, I'll give you a refund. Hand them over. Uh, sorry. Uh, Fink! <laughs> all right, is that it? Is that all you need? Haha, <laughs> yep, <laughs> that's it. Thank you so- I'm never coming here again. What's up guys? Live from the freaking trying on room. Already returned the leggings. Now I like these four pairs, which I'm not gonna buy four pairs of leggings because I will be broke if I do that. What the fuck do I do? <clears throat> So, I don't know, I'm gonna pick out which ones I want. <sighs> so hard to make decisions in this life. Okay, wish me luck. I fucking, I hate myself. Do you know what I just did? You wanna know what I just did? I hate myself. I just bought all four of those leggings. I bought all four of them. I hate myself. But you know what, I'm gonna do a fucking haul anyways. Please don't hate me for this. Black leggings that go all the way to the floor because the ones that I have literally will not fit over my toe. They're so small. I hate myself. If I'm gonna recommend a pair of Lululemon leggings to you, I would recommend these. They're the Align Pant 2. They are so soft. Like, okay, I got this color. I hate myself. These ones were on clearance. These like maroon with like these this stripe down the leg. So there's that. I hate myself. But these are cute. It's bad for me. I got these blue ones that were also on clearance. I don't like cropped leggings. I only like long leggings, which is funny because when I was younger, I only liked crop leggings. Crazy how times change. But yeah, so I did that and I'm mad at myself for it. 
no regrets, I guess. That was my haul. I hate myself. Okay, but on a happier note, I'm really about to hit some cars right now. So on a happier note, okay. Sorry, let's try that again. On a happier note, on a happier note, sorry, if I say on a happier note one more time, I'm, it's gonna be bad for me. I'm going to get me and my mom lunch right now from Asian Box. If you don't know what Asian Box is, it's so good. I'm gonna go get some of that for me and my mom because guess what? It's only 12.50, so I have time to get my mom lunch too and then bring it home to her before I get my hair done. I'm really feeling like an angel this afternoon to do something like that. It does kind of give me a stomach ache sometimes, but it's like, whatever, you know what I mean? To be completely honest, a lot of things give me a stomach ache. A lot of things give me a stomach ache. I have a very sensitive stomach. Like, I could literally eat any Anything and it gives me stomach pain. There's probably something wrong with me. Should probably get it checked out, but doctors don't know what it is. So sorry, that got a little bit deep. Um <laughs> So anyways Burritos are so good like when I was younger I never used to eat them because they kind of scared me for some reason I didn't like the idea of like everything being hidden inside of a tortilla and then me like biting into something aimlessly and like not knowing what's in there I don't know why but that always kind of scared me and startled me so I never ate burritos but then as I got older I was like fuck it bitch let's eat a burrito and then I ate one and I was like oh my god I can't believe where has this been all my life you know so yeah so now I love burritos but we're not getting a burrito right now, so calm down. We're getting Asian bars. <laughs> On a scale of one to 10, how shitty has this vlog been so far? Be honest. I hope I cut this all out. I'm probably gonna cut it all out. Emma, if you're watching this, just cut all that shit out. That was stupid. Um, And I'm fucking hungry. I need some food, baby. So let's go get it. Eskeed it. I hate myself. Should I get a to-go order and then do a mukbang in my car? Should I be that bitch? Even though I feel like mukbangs are so gross. Actually, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get it to-go and eat it in my car so that we can have a mukbang because we need fucking content, bitch. I'm gonna get it to-go and bring it back to my car. I'm kind of proud of that idea. Ooh, maybe I could do a mukbang Q&A. Like while I'm sitting here, like eating my food, I can like answer questions. Ugh, should I do that? Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. That could be so fun. Like a mukbang Q&A? Ugh! Oh, let's do it. Okay, let me tweet right now. Follow me on Twitter if you want all the latest updates. Hey guys! Tweet me weird ass questions right now. Let's see if people do it. I'm gonna add limited time only. We'll see if we get any good questions to answer while I'm hashtag mukbanging. But first we have to get our hashtag food. Can't wait to be a mukbang guru. I actually did a mukbang once and it was so fun, so I'm really glad that I'm bringing that back to my channel. Hashtag swag. Hashtag bae. Hashtag life. Okay guys, and welcome back to Emma's Mukbang channel. <clears throat> so let's get started. We have the Asian box. We have some tofu, veggies, rice, you know, just the works. I also got a coconut water because I was feeling a little bit spunky this afternoon. Good. First question of the mukbang. <laughs> have you ever eaten or thought of eating chapstick? When I was younger, I actually used to eat lip gloss often. I would eat lip gloss. I'm not proud of it. It was like my favorite snack. I'd get the lip gloss from Bath and Body Works and then I'd eat it. But this was when I was little, okay? I haven't done this in like a long time, so. But in honor of that question, let's take a little nibble of this. Oh God. Next question is, what's your favorite kind of soup? Well, that's a good question. I actually don't know. I'm skipping that. Next question. What languages can you speak? I can speak English pretty well. I mean, I'm not the best at it. And then I also took Spanish for like two years, but I'm pretty shitty at Spanish as well. So basically just English fam, you know, I'm just like not bilingual. <laughs> I immediately regret doing this mukbang because I don't like talking and eating at the same time. I think it's gross. That was just stupid on my part. All of you guys asked me such good questions that I feel bad not answering them. So, oh my God. <laughs> How much do you regret asking people to ask you questions? Literally so much, I regret it so much because I feel bad because you guys spent your time asking me questions and now I don't even want to answer them. If you could use only one chapstick for the rest of your life, which one would you use? I would probably use Carmex or, no, do you know what I would use? I'd probably use Aquaphor because although it's not that fun, it's the most effective. Like, Aquaphor genuinely, like, actually heals chapped lips. Like, all the other chapsticks, they, like, temporarily soothe your lips, but they don't actually, like, heal your chapped lips, but, like, Aquaphor actually heals them. So that's why Aquaphor is the best, but I just don't use it because I don't think it's as fun. Will you marry me? Fuck yeah. Would you be friends with yourself if you were a different person? Mm. I don't know. I cry a lot and like honestly, well, I don't cry in front of my friends, but well, honestly, I probably would, but I would just just because I'd feel bad for myself. I'd be like, "Well, you know, this poor little human needs a friend." So I'll be friends with her, but it would be a pity friendship. Does that even exist? If that exists, that's fine. 
up. How tall are you? I am in fact 5'4". I feel like 5'4 is a very average height. It's just very average. How often do you shower? Not enough. Okay, is water wet? No, water is not wet. Wet is a sensation that's caused by water. Water can't be wet because water is the cause of that sensation. <laughs> How long would you last living in Ikea? Literally, I think I could actually live in Ikea permanently because you have a shit ton of furniture and beds and shelter So you never like whatever you're never gonna feel lonely because there's always people shopping in there So you can just hang out with the shoppers, you know, and not only that but they have freaking food there, too Also, it's like fun. They also have soft serve ice cream. I mean fun Wait, do they have soft serve? I'm pretty sure Ikea has soft serve. Do you love memes as much as I do? <laughs> Fuck yeah. Even though I always find out about memes like a month after everyone else and I feel left out, but whatever. In your opinion, was ranch originally made for putting on salad or for dipping vegetables in? Honestly, I don't really care about either because ranch. I hate ranch dressing. I don't think I've ever hated something more in my life than I hate ranch. When I see it, I gag. When I think about it, I gag. I don't fuck with ranch. And because of that, I don't care about what, what it was fucking made for. I just hate ranch. Ranch is so bad, okay? Ranch is not okay. It's so bad. I know I'm probably offending many people right now, but I hate ranch. It looks gross. It tastes gross. I just don't get it. Same thing with mayonnaise. I just hate mayonnaise. Maybe I just don't like white things. Would you give this man a smooch? Oh, hell yeah. Guy Fieri. Or is it Fieri? Guy Fieri or Guy Fieri? Let me know down below. Do you pour the milk or the cereal first? Definitely cereal first. I don't know. That's just how my parents taught me to do it. That's it for my mukbang questions today. I can't do any more. Thank you if you asked me a question and I'm sorry that my answers were so boring. It's just that I wasn't really in the mood to elaborate about things because I'm eating. You know what I mean? That's why I'm never doing a mukbang again because I don't like to talk and eat at the same time. Now I have to go run home, bring my mom's food to my mom. Then we're gonna get my hair done. I'll see you when I'm getting my hair done. Peace, love, and happiness.